This video took me over four hours to record. I apologize that it took me so long to get this out, but now that I finally did it, I can safely say that this was probably the worst experience I've had in a very long time. Please enjoy. Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Pokemon Crystal. It's been a while, but in the last episode, we finished off pretty much everything that we could do in both the Kanto region and the Johto region. We went and defeated Red and did all that fun stuff, but there's still something else that we have to do. Now, I'm actually over here in Cherry Grove because it's actually a really quick swap between Route 29 and Cherry Grove right here. You might know what I'm talking about. So, I've already went through the liberty of getting ourselves a sleeper, which I aptly named Sleeper. Remember all the times I said, why would I ever use a Parasect? Well, too bad I'm using one anyways, because it knows the move Spore, which is a 100% accuracy sleep move. The only problem is that, you know, Parasect is incredibly slow and it's only level 28, but because it's not going to be really outleveled by anything, I just need Quick Law to go off to get the Spore and then everything will be hunky-dory. But yes, in this episode, I plan on catching both Raikou and Entai. And I've kind of been going through some stuff, trying to figure out how I want to do this. And then I will make probably a second bonus video with both uh, Ho-Oh and Lugia. So, without any further ado, let's get started. Um, probably going to be a little slow going forward, but Hey, if we find them, that's great. If we don't, this is going to hopefully not be a very long video. So, anyways, what we gotta do? Head over to this. Woo! Thank fucking god. Okay, we get Raikou first. That only took me like, you know, half an hour. All right, I highly doubt this is going to work, but. That's fine. Alright, so we finally found one of them. Let's go! Okay, um, now what we can do. By the way, um, quick note. I am by Ecritique now. Um, it's, it's actually recommended not to go between two routes, which I was doing. No wonder I couldn't find them for the first, like, 15 minutes. But, uh, yeah. What you want to do is that you want to go down... Uh, I can actually show you, I think, on my Poke gear. Um, so, go from Ecruteague City, you go from 37 to 36, and then you go down to 35. And then you would just fly back to Ecruteague and then just do it again. Just go back and forth, back and forth. And all that good stuff. So, now we want to open up the Pokedex. There we go. Hi, Raikou. Now, I want to quick actually check something. Before I do anything... Um... I'm not really sure which one's faster. It's probably Raikou. But I suppose I don't have much of a choice. By the way... Um, since this is technically the very first legendary theme in the Pokemon series, I think you deserve to actually listen to it, so, um, after this attempt, the next time that we, uh, hear it, I'll let you listen from the beginning, because it's really good. But anyways, now that we finally got Raikou, let's try and outspeed it with, with the power of Quick Claw. It worked! That wasn't supposed to work right away! Alright, so now that it's fast asleep, we want to swap to Cowbell and smack it with Sludge Bomb. So it's still asleep. And Sludge Bomb. Yeah, it actually outspeeds Cowbell, which is kind of funny. I went through the liberty of looking, this will not one-shot it, unless it crits.
Yes! <laughs> Thank you, game. You're the best! Yes! You're the best! This rough Pokemon stores energy inside its body, then sweeps across the land, shooting off electricity. No. <sighs> the game knew that I was looking for that. The game is actually nice to me? That's impossible. Okay, well now that that's done, I just need Entai to show up. So that's the fun part. Now I get to do it all over again. I, if you saw that, I sped up. I started to speed up, and the first patch of grass that I hit was immediately anti. <coughs> this brawny Pokemon courses around the earth, sprouting flames hotter than a volcano's magma. No. Well. Now that that's done, and I can safely say... That, uh, that was not very fun at all. So, uh, let's save. So, uh, Before I... actually, no. No, I'll just... I am not recording another video today. I might do it later tonight, but I don't feel like recording anything anymore. Not not after this. Maybe maybe tomorrow or something, but... I think I'll, I'll rest easy knowing that in the span of four hours I caught two legendaries. But guess what? They're the two that I needed. Obviously, since I caught something, I have to scroll all the way to the bottom to even show it, but... Hey, you know what? It's like I said. It took me two hours to catch Raikou. It'll take me two hours to catch Entai. Entai's are just so much more frustrating because I never saw it. I'm gonna dub... I'm gonna save again because I don't care. I'm paranoid. Anyways, now that that's done, I still need to, uh, because obviously I'm here because I want to go to the World Islands to catch Lugia, and then we'll go back to Ecritique City, back to the Tin Tower, and then we will, uh, I think it's the Tin Tower, whichever one has ho on it, but yeah. So, until then, see you guys later, have a good one, and bye bye